Saubona. Yebo Saubona. Unjani. Gia Pila, Unjani well. Gia Pila. Uya Pi. Gia Enu Vesi. Limono Ipas. Libiza Maini. Amadola, Amadini. Gizotata Ipas. Kulungi, Hamaras. Now, how do you say I am going? Um, you've heard in many times in that conversation they were using Ngiya. So, the main thing to talk about here is Ya, which is Ya. Ya is a verb that means going. But as I've said this before, um, this is a verb that just never goes along. Um, you have to prefix a concord or a person, a subject, uh, that is doing something in an action. For example, in a conversation it said, Ngiya in your face. The same can uh, be, be said if I'm going to school, you can say, Ngiya esikolini. Or you can say, Ngiya a restaurant. It is also important to understand that that verb ya can only be used in a present continuous tense. You will learn later what are other verbs that could be used for going if it's in the past tense or if it doesn't happen now and continuously. You've heard about here from that conversation of Ngiya in your verse. It is also important to note that the ya is not always used as a verb. The ya can be used just to show a tense, a present continuous tense. For example, if I say, I drink, in Zulu you say, puza. You can say, ngi ya puza. That is using ya, but that ya has nothing to do with going. Later in other lesson, we will cover this aspect of year. Thank you. Salam alaikum.